about to present to you this special project. But first, we need you guys to close your eyes and just very close them. Go with us in a time machine. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Go to maybe 1995. Okay, open your eyes. You're in your childhood living room and you're about to watch uh, an entire night of Saturday Night Nickelodeon. Um, but before we watch, before we start our episode of You Are Afraid of the Dark, uh, we need the name of a tale. So, uh, for an example, last week's tale was the tale of the gory trampoline. So for tonight, I need two things from you. Uh, the first being a spooky adjective, and the other being a noun. Uh, so, if anyone has an adjective they'd like to share? Or Haunted. Haunted. Okay, thank you. And a noun? Doll. Doll. Mm. We now present the tale of the haunted doll. Soccer socks. What up, losers? Get my socks. Thank you. What, you guys don't do it in the socks, I I was not brought into the socks. I don't, we share a room, and yeah. she doesn't like to know. I, yeah, I'm, she's like, whatever you're doing, I don't want to know that. It's on that side. It's on the left side. Yeah, I'm just so stoked I got this It's not even a contest. No, I think no. there's a valid thing to discuss here. Peanut no, M&M. <laughs> it's not a contest. Regular on. You guys, can you settle this for us? Regular M&M's. Peanut. Yeah. I could settle it for you if we all pitched in to do a blind study. Whoa. Yeah, I don't I don't think that's gonna work because you'll know the difference. Like you yeah, know you one has a peanut <laughs> and one doesn't. It's more like a, a preference. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> she didn't bring any of the M Ms attached. It's just the peanuts. <laughs> Sorry, I was repeating peanuts to myself, and I just lost the whole M Ms piece. Kind of meaty. Yeah, you should eat regular M Ms and then chase them with the peanuts. Yeah. I'm an allergy. Oh, I'm so sorry, oh. I thought you had drama because my heat. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Still? She's all over my back because I get bad grades and I don't care. <laughs> yeah, I care about the bad grades. No, you were trying to take my spot on the soccer team, okay? Too bad I got it. You can feel it all the way. Speaking of the soccer team, um, that actually reminds me of the story I want to tell today. That's why we Submitted for the approval of the Midnight Society, I call this story the tale of a haunted doll. <laughs> Richard and Chris Ann were best friends at Davenport Central High School. They played soccer together. Richard on the boys team, Chris Ann on the girls team. One day, they're at the soccer field after hours, working on their teams. <laughs> Nail in this routine. <laughs> Your routine's better than mine. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for uh, meeting me here today. I'm just hanging out again. Yeah, I like just hanging out at the soccer field after hours. Yeah. It's, it's, uh, it's more fun than being at home. Uh, your parents uh, still dragging out that divorce? Yeah, but it's, it's good. It's like what makes everyone happy, you know? <laughs> I mean, it's sometimes if people are happier if they're farther apart from each other. It's like distance, but not you and I. No, not you and I. I'll get my ball. <laughs> <laughs> we usually like kick the ball back forth, but you're going through some stuff today, so. <laughs> We love you 
so, 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 so much. And I know things are changing, and I know it's scary, but we love you so much. I love you, like, you know, a lot. We know. <laughs> <laughs> But like, if you were going to, right, like, we would know. Yeah, we would, I don't know. But anyway, sweetie, how was soccer? Oh, yeah, yeah. Was everything. I worked on my uh, victory dance for when I saw all the games on Friday. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Last time was so much fun. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you were so talented. What can Chris A do? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you do. Okay, so your next game is on Saturday, right? Yeah, okay. So which one of us would you like to go to? But, uh, little wine punch. Oh my god. <laughs> my little bullet okay. girl. Yeah, I guess. I have a lot of sugar. Um, no, no, no. It's after no. 2 p.m. and that sugar is like a little much, so. Yeah, but yeah. she's like, just she needs to re uh, get some hydration and some electrolytes in there. <laughs> <laughs>
the shop. Oh, my husband 
never let me be Big Spoon. Ooh, the patriarchy, right? <laughs> that sent me the dolls. There's a company that made this? <laughs> they were supposed to be. The thing is, is I called, and it just kept ringing and ringing. So I looked up the address uh, in the phone book. <laughs> <laughs> Top of the line check dog. 666 Wichita Place, Salem, Massachusetts. <laughs> Did you actually call that number? <laughs> yes. That feels bad to me when I hear that number. That, well, that was the address. The phone number was very generic. <laughs> <laughs> Children, children, I've heard horrible things about that place. I mean, you know, the family that used to live there, they... I know, no. Mr. Aaron, you don't understand, okay? When you showed us those dolls, I was like, ugh, dolls. And then I was like... Ugh, scary dolls. But I had a connection with that doll. That doll knew my name, it knew my favorite color, it knew what I wanted to it be. It knows when I grew everything up. about it you. It knew what my husband's name would be in the future. It said all the things that I wanted to hear. Like, no like, one else ever had! It was like playing the best game of match in my life. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta get that doll back, Mr. Aaron. Get that doll back, Mr. Aaron. Come you on. You can't touch those dolls again. <laughs> those aren't just regular dolls. The family that lived there. They were into some bad stuff. Six 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 Wichita. Thanks for coming with me. Return the doll. <laughs> I didn't come all the way up here after looking this up in the yellow pages for nothing. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Play with me. Okay. Hello? That was the doll. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah. Hello? Because I was Adrian. <laughs> 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 
foyer. <laughs> to go back the way they were. And I want people 
to watch my soccer game and things to be about me for once. You don't actually love each other, and that's okay! 
You have raised an amazing daughter who's an amazing soccer player. But right now, there is a doll that has possessed both of your souls, and we have to get rid of it. Where is it? <sighs> I followed you here. <laughs> what you guys were saying. It's wrong that I'm doing the bidding of these people. The only way to get rid of it is if it's taking a possession of one last soul. Give me the doll. Where's the doll? <laughs> I've been hiding it. Please! <laughs> Separate, but better, you know? Yeah. Anyway. All right. 